What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalie. If you didn't know, now you know. If you haven't subscribed yet, you better do it now because right now I am in Japan proving to you all what's possible with your life. And right now I left everything behind. I don't have an apartment. I don't have a job. I don't have bills to pay. I do not have nothing. The only thing I have is my, my body, this, this, this body and whatever is in my bag right now that's all i have and this is the best journey i've been so far so last time i updated you i was in okayama prefecture in the city of okayama obviously and then um after that i went to onomichi which is a city in Hiroshima prefecture. Um, I met a few friends over there. That's why you I haven't been posting um, Because I have been with friends and then we went on this scenic bicycle ride Which was beautiful and I think we like I, I, I did film this a little bit on my real camera, but we did something like 70 kilometers it was awful well it was great but it was awful it was really hard on the knees and the legs but i'm really happy i've done it because i like to push myself out of my comfort zone i'm loving to really push myself to my limit and that day was like oh my god i needed to climb upstairs to get to my hotel i was like oh my god why why life why <laughs> But I really had a great time in Onomichi. We were staying at this hostel where um, we were on top of a mountain on like in the middle like of a historical tour um, and it was really beautiful. Onomichi is a city where it's well known in Japan to look like, like it was frozen into time because while the economy crashed in Japan in the 1990s, um, I think the city was abandoned for a while. So a lot of the houses are still up that most of them are still abandoned but now what they're doing is they're restoring the old houses and renovating uh, instead of like putting them down and real building they're actually renovating the old houses and the hotel i said is actually one of those houses that was abandoned so that was super fun um after that i went to totori prefecture totori prefecture is known to have a desert so there's this big sand dune i went to the sand dunes i wanted to have a camel ride but i didn't go on the camel ride because it wasn't a camel ride in the desert it was just like oh get on the camel and like right into one circle and it's finished i was like okay that's not worth my money so i didn't do the camel ride and then i had a self-care there the, the, the next day went to the onsen i took care of myself i relaxed my knees and then now i'm here in Fuk well I, I slept last night in hiroshima because i don't like really to take trains it really exhausts me to uh, all that transport even though it's it, it, it's easy and it's fast but um, I still don't like it <laughs> I don't like taking trains it's not my favorite thing in the world so I took the train I went to Hiroshima prefecture in Hiroshima city I went to a hotel that I knew of so it was super fun and I bought these pastries that I'm super in love with because they're super yummy and there's these like little maple leaf like pastries and if you're in Hiroshima you need to buy yourself some because they're delicious they're hands down delicious you need to get you some and then now I'm here in Fukuoka Prefecture. I think I'm in the city named Kokura, 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 something like that. And then um, I saw there's a castle nearby and a park, so I'll go see the castle and I'll make a real vlog with my camera. So when I come back to Canada, you'll get to see all the beautiful views I've seen. And yeah, other sides than that, um, I joined a group named uh, MetaLife, which is a platform where Sam and Colby, the YouTubers, um, made. Um, they they made that platform to really have like a positive group um, and a, like where p people can help each other achieve their goals and like overcome like anxiety and whatever. I joined the group because. Um, I just want to help people. I, one of my purpose in life, what really makes me happy is like one, uh, helping the planet, two, helping people reaching their goals. So I've been through some training beforehand and I'm really like goal driven right now and I'm really 
it's really make it's really fun helping other people and like connecting with people um and helping them on their own goals like they were mine because sometimes you need to help other people on their goals and their like path to reach your own so that's what i'm doing right now i'm like undercover <laughs> coaching people on <laughs> this platform called meta life and i'm really having the time of my life and right now i'm putting my cell phone away um, and then I'm just gonna visit this town because that's what's possible guys. I'm gonna share this on the middle life group um, so guys you can see what's possible and I've been there guys. I've been there where you are and This is my life now My past is not it doesn't define who I am and This is my life now. I'm the creator of my life and I do whatever I want See you. Bye